Let's solve one important problem in displacement current density. Find the displacement current density within a parallel plate capacitor where the epsilon is equal to 10 times the epsilon naught, A is equal to 0 0.01 meter squared and D is equal to 5 centimeter. The capacitor voltage is given as 100 sine 314 T volts. So in this one, first we are going to write the given data. Here the epsilon value is 10 times the epsilon naught value. Area is equal to 0 0.01 meter squared. The separation between the plates is D is equal to 5 centimeter. It can be written like this 5 into 10 to the power minus 2 meter. Here the voltage is equal to 100 sine 314 T. So here the formula is the displacement current density JD is equal to epsilon by D dou V by dou T. If we want to find out displacement current, we can use the formula JD into A. Okay. So first we are going to substitute the values of epsilon, D and V in this formula to get the displacement current density. So JD is equal to epsilon is equal to 10 times epsilon naught divided by D is 5 into 10 to the power minus 2 dou by dou T of 100 sine 314 T. Okay, so here we can take this 100 outside. So 10 into 100, 1000 into epsilon naught value is 8.854 into 10 to the power minus 12 divided by 5 into 10 to the power minus 2. Here the differentiation of sin is plus cos. So differentiation of sin 314 T is cos 314 T. Here we can have this value that can be multiplied here. Correct? So then we can get the answer as 5.6 into 10 to the power minus 5 cos of 314 T. So its unit is amps per meter squared. So if you want to find out the displacement current, we can simply multiply this JD value with the area. So here we can simply multiply this value 5.6 into 10 to the power minus 5 cos of 314 T multiplied with the area is what 0.01. Okay, then we can get the value as 5.6 into 10 to the power minus 7 cos of 314 t. Do you all understand?